what we had arrived at together, which was, you know, under her, uh, you know, extremely focused influence, was that pharmaceutical drugs are poisons. And as such, the immune system is mobilized to deal with that poison. And so you not only have the effects on homeostasis, like a blood pressure medication, what it does is it disrupts homeostasis. It doesn't balance your blood pressure. It disrupts homeostasis. It is a poison. And so you not only have to have your body try to go from the high blood pressure state to the induced poison that creates a low blood pressure state, but then you got to detoxify the shit and try to get it out of your body. And so what happens is when you are exposed to drugs and especially injectable drugs, they act as if they are foreign agents and your body, your body has, and I call it continuum, within the hypersensitivity reactions, you got like four different pathways that you can follow, but that's just the subgroup of how your body deals with foreign substances, and there's like five things that go on. Allergy, addiction, and that's what we were focusing on. Me and Roxy were trying to figure out why is it that people are literally addicted to pharmaceutical drugs, street drugs, uh, Stephanie Senna from MIT said people are literally addicted to Roundup pesticide. And then you got your hypersensitivity reactions. You've got um, uh, detoxification that has to occur. These are all immune system responses. And your body is like, it, it, it's like a, a frenzy. One of those, those uh, time-lapsed photos of like a city where all the traffic is going through, starting and stopping, and then you know, clear out for rush hour, and then it all kind of calms down. That's what your body is trying to do with any injectable, with any drug taken orally or injected. And so the, the line blurs, and it becomes an academic um, ex, uh, just exploration of what's the difference between a pharmaceutical drug and what they call a biological, because that's what they call vaccines which is just one word away from biological warfare agent. So, Clint, what you're saying is drugs, whether they're labeled as vaccines or not, are going through the same factory process in the body as a vaccine. 